Hello everyone and welcome back for my final daily report market analysis video of today, Thursday the 9th of July. With me, Richard Perry, market analyst at Handtech. We're going to look at gold, which has broken out decisively above 1800 bucks. a really strong move. Two sessions in a row we've actually been breaking out. 1789 was the original resistance from last week. We broke out on Tuesday. We had a decisive move higher yesterday, closing above 1800 bucks. That's a that's a new high that dates back to 2011 now. And um, the, it's a really strong move, actually. I really like this. A um, little bit of a, a sort of impetus lost this morning. Little sort of rolling over on the momentum, just as that unwinds a little bit. But I still think intraday corrections are going to be bought into. I think you've got decent support, arguably around 1800 bucks coming in as a psychological level now. But 1789 is the breakout. You've got the uptrend that comes in at 1780 and down at 1764 is the next breakout. But I, th I still think if you hold this uptrend, I think it's a good move to buy into the weakness. I think it's uh, just a, a look at the strength of the momentum. RSI sort of moving above 70. That was the first time we've seen that move above 70 since February on the RSI. And that is uh, an impressive move, I think. And I think it's going to be bought into um, into in terms of how the market is viewing this one now. Um, I sort of taken this as an upside break from a consolidation tr um, rectangle. And if you take that as a consolidation between April, May and June and project that higher, you can get from a conservative basis around about 1820, but you could even get as high as 18. 58 as an upside projection target. So there is, I think, further moves to the upside. I think that weakness will be bought into. Look for supported weakness, I would add. You've got some decent support, as I said, 1789 to 1797, arguably on the hourly chart. And I think that, that as this hourly RSI and MACD lines and stochastics unwind a bit, renew upside potential, I think it will be bought into. I think that this is going to be an ongoing um, bull run that we see in the coming weeks. Um, and with that regard, any up, any sort of supported weakness into support that starts to find legs and bull run again, I think is a chance to buy. And I think that um, it's a, it looks uh, looks like a decent chart. Initially, as I said, we might see some corrective move, but ultimately, I still see further upside potential in this move. Re um, initial resistance 1817, 1818 from yesterday's high, but essentially 1820 is the first real target from that um, consolidation rectangle break. And I think that now we've cleared out the way of 1795, which was um, the big 2012 high, you're now open for the all time highs of 1920 again. So that uh, certainly could be on the cards in the coming weeks if these balls continue to go as they are. So with that in mind, I wish you good luck in your trading today. Click here to subscribe to our analysis videos. Go to our website, sign up for our webinars and click to watch our Trader Talks videos to gain some top trading ideas.